History. Passive house equals passive house equals passive building. Energy recovery ventilation, solar gain, thermal mass, orientation, dwellings that achieved comfort, all originated in the ancient cultures around world and practiced for millennia. The ancient cultures of all our ancestors. Fully developed solar architecture and urban planning methods were employed by the Egyptian, Babylonians, the Chinese followed by the Greeks. Solar design was largely abandoned in Europe after the fall of Rome but continued unabated in China where cosmological traditions associate the South with summer, warmth and health. Although earlier experimental solar houses were constructed using a mixture of active and passive solar techniques, some of the first European engineered passive solar houses of the modern era were built in Germany after World War I, when the Allies occupied the Ruhr area including most of Germany's coal mines. Architect George F. Keck was a pioneering designer of passive solar houses in the 1930s and 40s. In 1940 designed a passive solar home for real estate developer Howard Sloan in Glenview, Illinois. The Sloan house was called a solar house by the Chicago Tribune, the first modern use of that term. Sloan then built a number of passive solar houses and his publicity efforts contributed to a significant solar house movement in the 1940s. Frank Lloyd Wright used passive solar principles in some of his designs, most notably in the Jacobs House, built in 1944 in Wisconsin, which was also known as the Solar Hemicycle or Solar Hemicyclo. Interest in conservation waned in the United States for many years during most of the 20th century. Passive solar technologies were incrementally refined and greatly improved aided by the development of 3D computer modeling techniques. The Europeans refined the application of passive principles and spawned demand for high-performance products. Dr. Wolfgang Feist and Dr. Bo Adamson led the effort to refine the principles and develop the design techniques and the passive house performance metric. The first passive house was built in Darmstadt, Germany. Feist went on to found the Passive House Institute, which is headquartered in Darmstadt. The University of Illinois at Urbana-Champaign had been a hotbed of innovation in building energy efficiency in the 1970s and 1980s, and is where the term superinsulation was coined. In modern times, we have added different forms of superinsulation, airtight envelopes, high-performance windows, and more. Passive houses have not been invented by anyone, in fact, the passive house principle was discovered 